Well, good Friday evening, everyone. I know it's super late, but that's okay. Staying up chit-chatting with a friend, which I really enjoy doing. But anyway, so this morning, I got to go walking with Mom again. We went in on an inside track and walked a mile. And then we went to the post office, but nothing was there yet. And then we went to the grocery store and walked more. And then I came home and put things away. And then she and I played a little game called Bananas. You have to look into it. It's fun if you enjoy making like word puzzles. It's a good game. And then I walked again this evening. So I'm going to say my strength training was my leg training today. I stayed on my feet for a lot of today. And my legs are all achy. <laughs> so I'll make sure to take something before I go to bed. So they're not so achy tomorrow or overnight or giving me issues overnight. And let's see. Oh, I had some exciting news. So I did go back to lose a pound. So I am eight pounds down. I did have, a, I guess you could say, two things today that weren't the best. Um, one, um, whenever we went to the store, I look for, um, Cadbury. They have, um, really creamy chocolate, and then, in some of them, they do caramel, and some of them, they do, um, fruit and nut, and so I got me one of those bars of chocolate, and I had it for lunch. I put just a few pieces on a plate, but I ended up having the whole bar between lunch and dinner, so <laughs> it was just good. So there's no more chocolate left in the house, though. And then this evening, after dinner, I was like, I've been so hungry for popcorn. And so the way I do it is I have kernels, and then I put them in a pan over the stove. And I don't put any oil or butter, you know, you don't necessarily have to have that. And I don't put any salt or pepper in them or anything, you know, like that whenever I'm first making it. So then I get it, you know, nice and hot, get it popping, get all... You know, make sure all of them don't burn. So move it just, you know, every few seconds. Move it a little bit so it doesn't burn. And then while that was going, I got me some of my unsalted real butter. And put a little bit of brown sugar. Probably, I would say, a fourth of a cup or less of brown sugar with butter. And just kind of melted it down. And then when the popcorn was done, I spread it out over a cookie sheet and then put the melted butter and brown sugar over it and then put a lot of it in a bag for later this week and then ate a bowl of it. So you'll see that bowl and that's what that is. It's homemade um, kind of caramel popcorn. Not too, too much sugar, not too, too much butter. But just enough to have that nice little sweet taste, especially when you're craving something like that. So that's how I do that. And then, yeah, tonight just been trying to relax and take it easy. Enjoy catching up with a friend. And so, yeah, that's how my day went. And, um, uh, yeah. I already announced something that's coming up this week, so this will be one of the videos to comment on. So I'm just giving you a little hint. <laughs> anyway, I hope y'all are doing well. I hope y'all have had a great day. I have had a good day. I got um, to spend time with Casper, and we had fun today. And just, it was nice to upload a little video of him today, so it was good. And then I did um, get um, the vet office that I had taken Moki to when she had passed. And they're the ones, you know, that um, took care of everything for me for her um, after she had passed. She had passed away on our way there. And then they made sure they took real good care of her and made sure um, everything was taken care of. So then I could take her home the um, that Monday. And anyway, so they all, their whole office signed um, this beautiful sympathy card and, you know, wrote just really sweet messages on there and just 
it was sweet. It did make me cry a little bit today, and that's okay. You know, that's one of those things, you know, she was my little girl for 14 years. I had her all her life except for a month, and so, you know, she's my sweet little smoky cat, and that's part of life, you know. Unfortunately, that'll happen with our animals and people in our life and things, but we just have to take it day by day and moment by moment sometimes. But anyway, I hope y'all are doing really well. If you have anything you need me to pray for, please let me know. You can message me at Heather has to start somewhere at gmail.com if you don't want to share it with anybody. I understand that. It'll only be for my eyes and for the Lord's eyes because the Lord will see it and I'll take it to him in prayer. So I hope y'all are doing great. I hope you had a good Friday, and remember, hit that like button if you like this video, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and want to join my journey. I have over 100 people now that join it. That's so cool. Thank y'all so much. Oh my goodness, y'all are such a huge blessing to me, and don't forget the notification bell so you know every time I drop a video. And I will catch you tomorrow.